Um, good evening, dear audience. I'm the Professor Mason Wong from Royal Society of Chemistry UK. I recently had a panel at the quarter and the president of AIPBI Japan, uh, Mr. Kaneji Nagasawa, and I joined the uh, Japan IP High Call Formal Chief Judge in Rock, CFC Formal Chief Judge Writer, Germany Federal Parliament Co Presiding Judge Board, um, President Kwang Jong King from Lessons the Executive Society Korea and Intellectual Discovery, uh, the books of Law Policy and Monetization uh, on Intellectual Property, which will be published by Kemsko Publishers soon. And today, Nagasawa san and I are both seeing a beautiful Milan attending AIPBI 2016 Annual Congress. We are honored to have Ken, uh, Mr. Nagasawa san who is the head of Kano uh, IP, to join us, sharing the highlights in our book and updating for the current situation in Japan. Nagasawa san, would you like to say hello to our audience? Uh, I think that they are joining uh, They have to be uh, so, uh, Probably. Here in the evening, in the evening. Uh, Nagasawa-san uh, is the editor of our book, the title Law Policy and Monetization of Intellectual Property, and also of our chapter titled Right to Demand Injunction, the Problem of Patent Asserting Entities and Standing uh, Standard Essential Patents. Would Nagasawa-san kindly share the actions in your chapter? Yeah, my chapter, many talk about the standard essential patents, uh, which should be, you know, uh, limited to the uh, you know, enforcement of the injunction. And especially, in recent, some of the standard essential patent is uh, exponentially increased, uh, like uh, LTE, like, uh, you know, MPEG. And in that case, uh, 7,000 patents are essential. It also, that's what the technology, the infrastructure of the society. And the society, and if you stop training the brain, it's a huge problem. It's almost the same problem, it might be happen. Like if you can give in all the injunction rights for 7,000 patents. That's my you know, main story. Thank you very much for Nagasawa-san's uh, explanation. We're wondering, would you mind to uh, elaborate a little bit what's the scope and the why of a uh, the essential standard pattern? So, it's sometimes, uh, uh, some entity uh, submit in a uh, F-Grant declaration, but uh, some entity doesn't want to submit that sort of statement. If we distinguish, it's very bad. And therefore, um, uh, standard essential patent has to be decided at the, the scope of the trade. Yes, thank you very much. You are the head of IP Volcano. Are we wondering, would you mind share yeah. some of the real tests okay. How can of defend uh, PAE and the suggestion for corporate to avoid the patent trap? Um, so one of the examples is recently software related patent is not, you know, uh, allowed in military. They will have some countermeasure with some CBM or something like this. And especially after the Alice decision, and we might have CBM. Then some of the PAE military get drawn with some of the discussion. Okay. It's one of the countermeasures. Thank you very much, Nagasawa Song, for sharing uh, your uh, precious uh, experience and the insight in our book, which will be published soon. I sincerely hope all the Asian and uh, countries can work together as the Asian Alliance for Greater Competence to balance the economics and politics influence from the United States and Europe. I further hope there will be more innovative, creative technology and product with reasonable price to improve the goodness of a human being. Our first book is essential reading for anyone who is involved or interested in intellectual property law. I will also appeal to those who are in the business world concerning with managing direct property and confronting competition with smart strategy. Um, our second book will done numerous pressing issues such as licensing, uh, litigations, merger acquisition on intellectual property rights. We further complementary by in-depth cap, in cap studies such as smart vehicles, online payment, virtual reality, augmented reality, such as so-called VIAR, and transgenic technology, uh, GMO, LED industry, semiconductor industries. Uh, this, book uh, this book demonstrates 
how companies can benefit enormously from the integrated application of all kinds of intellectual property rights. We hope soon we will have an opportunity again to invite Dr. Uh, Sosan again to share his excellency wisdom for corporate review on IP management soon. Thank you very much, Dr. Sosan. Thank you.